27 and 1. That's the combined record of Newfield and Watkins Glen basketball and one of the most anticipated games of the regular season. Tonight marks a battle of champions. Undefeated Newfield heads to Watkins Glen in an IAC showdown. Both teams claim their prospective conference titles. The Trojans have the small school South Championship while the Senecas own the large school South Hardware. Both teams are state ranked in Class C and both teams fighting for the number one seed heading into sectionals. An outcome that could be decided by this game. This one is set to be a thriller tip off scheduled for seven at Watkins Glen High School. Check out WENY at 11 for a full recap with sports director Amy Milnoski. And the latest New York State rankings, both Newfield and Watkins Glen on the move. Plus, Notre Dame making the jump onto the state watch list after the Crusaders upset Watkins Glen at home with this nice overtime buzzer beater. Notre Dame now cracks the countdown at 20th. Newfield also making some gains. The Trojans continue their undefeated streak and now move to 6th place in Class C, while Watkins Glen falls from 13th to 15th. In football, Elmira won the sectional title in 2013. Corning claimed it in 2014. Both programs merging their area schools for success. Now in Schuyler County, Watkins Glen and Odessa Montour are one step closer to combining. The Watkins Glen Board of Education given the green light to merge the two football programs. The board unanimous, unanimously approved the merger. Now it's the Indians' turn to decide. If passed, this would mean a brand new team, logo, mascot, and more in time for the start of the 2015 season. Odessa forfeited last year after a lack of players, while Watkins Glen has battled with a drop in numbers over the recent years. But the Senecas now making their decision clear, they want football in the future. I think that football is such a wonderful, fantastic game. I would hate to see it lost to an entire school district. And I think that that's the most important thing is that we're keeping football alive with any way that we can that's possible. We want to compete and we want to do whatever it takes to compete. And looking ahead, Thursday will decide the fate of the two football programs with Watkins already approving the merger. Odessa Montour must as well to combine the two. The Indians Board of Education meeting will start Thursday at 6. The meeting will be open to the public.